Columbus Scotus Shamrocks are one of eight teams remaining in the Class C-1 state football tournament after knocking off the Bishop Newman Cavaliers last week. After a one-point regular season victory, the Shamrocks were able to win a bit more comfortably in the first round, eliminating Bishop Newman with a 48-28 win. Starting quarterback Tyler Palmer accounted for four touchdowns, throwing two and running two in, and Dalton Borchers threw two touchdowns as well. The win was SCOTUS's first playoff victory since its 2015 state championship season, and they are now moving on to another regular season rematch in the quarterfinal round. SCOTUS will be heading on the road Friday to face the unbeaten Wahoo Warriors, who defeated Boys Town 56 to nothing last week in the first round. In the regular season finale, Wahoo took down SCOTUS 49 to nothing in a game that SCOTUS head coach Tyler Linder says his team was well prepared for despite the final score. We didn't take them lightly. That wasn't like they just caught us off guard. They're just, they're that good, you know, and I and I think, you know, the first half is a testament to that. Scoreless first quarter, so our defense was huge for us early. It's hard to, you know, wrangle a team like that for four quarters, and they really busted it wide open in that third quarter, but our kids prepared extremely well for that game, but we have to execute better, and we can't have any mistakes in order, you know, if we, if we have a chance to win a game like that. So it was good to learn that and get that humbling experience, and, and that's a good reality check for us getting into the playoffs that we have to do everything right. The Shamrocks will have another crack at the Warriors this weekend in Wahoo as they look to not only hand the Warriors their first loss of the season, but earn the first postseason victory over Wahoo in school history. Reporting in Columbus, I'm Alex Loroff, NCN Sports Now.